as you seen in the crash uh, to validate this crash there are many sensors used and there are they are fitted in certain locations let's explore their locations and what are the sensors fixed in the vehicle now the weight pad sensor so for each uh, the vehicle has four wheels so it there is a weight pad for for each and every wheel okay so this weight pad has connected to this data logger so here we can see the weight if uh, i play so currently i will be setting it to zero so if there is any other i'll calibrate to zero if i apply the load on the vehicle the weight is increasing this is how it is validated next going inside the car starting with steering angle sensor so in this uh, we are exploring the steering angles and that uh, force applied on the steering wheel okay both we will be able to observe here you can come here and see next sensor we are having is steering angle sensor it not alone uh, shows you steering angle it shows the force applied on uh, on the steering also here you can see uh, the uh, steering angle sensor is uh, logging data here and it is visible here so once i uh, turn the steering wheel you can see the uh, change in the degree steering angle degree it is very and the force applied is also very so by this you can lock the steering angle uh, steering angles and the force applied to the steering wheel okay coming to next sensor uh, brake force sensor it is fitted with the brake pedal here you can see it here you can see it this is the uh, brake force sensor fitted to brake pedal so during in in, in case of a emergency or panic braking conditions you will be suddenly applying the brake so that time how much force is applied to this brake pedal you will be able to calculate this or you can log this data and you uh, use it for further uh, further processes all those things coming to next sensor we have accelerometer accelerometer is uh, fixed here to measure the acceleration of your vehicle so how quickly your vehicle is accelerating you will be able to capture the data from this accelerometer and that data can be used for further processes so going to next sensor you have g sensor g sensor uh, is used to measure the x y z axis of your vehicle this is used for like uh, suspension how suspension is moving and how much braking is applied so all those x y z axis you will be able to capture with this and this data can be used for validation purposes coming to next sensor here we have a analog g sensor you can see the analog readings here once you press the accelerator so this will be showing the acceleration how quickly you can accelerate so uh, it is same as the accelerator sensor accelerator sensor which is located bottom that will be giving you the digital reading whereas this will be showing you a analog reading so these are the some of the sensors which is used for validation of the data during a crash or during the testings thank you